Hey, what is up guys? I device help here and Apple today released iOS 10.1 beta 5. Yes, you heard right. iOS 10.1 beta 5 has been released today on Wednesday and Monday Apple released beta 4 for iOS 10.1. And I do have to say there's one significant change and I'll get to that here in a few seconds. But before we continue, this could be hinting at iOS 10.1 as I anticipated a few days ago of being released next week with the announcement of new Macs. We're anticipating a new release of iOS 10.1 next week and a new release of new fresh hardware for the MacBooks. So we'll have to stay tuned here for that. But I do want to point out 1.5 is what this download was. Interestingly enough, that is a huge file size for the fifth beta. This could be hinting at this being the gold master copy, the GM, again, hinting at next week, the final release. And Apple did release it for developers and the public as well. So all developers and all beta testers, public beta testers can go right now to the over the air updates and you will get prompted for the fifth beta of iOS 10.1. Now the build number also changed. This is beta four, iOS 10.1 beta four, 14B, 72B. Here is beta 5 today here in settings, iOS 10.1, 14B72C. Okay, so we'll keep an eye there on the build number to see if the official release next week or whenever it comes is the same build number Then we know that this was the official release for iOS 10.1. I also wanted to point out the performance did come back yesterday or Monday. We talked about the performance going down gradually from 1, 2, 3, 4, and now 5th beta. We see that now from the 4th, which was Monday, 34.33 to 34.44, that's a slight bump. And we have 55.77 multi-core score from a previous 5541. So it is an increase as well. So good signs of this being the final release of iOS 10.1. Now the one change I do want to talk about is the new portrait mode option inside of the photos application for the iPhone 7 Plus. It is so stable, so fast, so much different from the previous beta, beta 4, believe it or not. In just a few days, Apple managed to change and stabilize this feature a lot. It's a lot faster, snappier, quicker. Unfortunately, I don't have my other iPhone here running the beta 4 to compare it with, but it is a lot faster and it feels a lot more stable. Of course, the OS is prime time, ready to go, guys. This is it. This is the official, in my opinion, of iOS 10.1. Stay tuned for more updates and videos. No new features, guys. No new wallpapers, unfortunately. No dark mode. I don't even know if those are going to be coming anymore. And we didn't see any new wallpapers. I doubt that we'll see them now. But I'm still anticipating a dark mode. Apple could be holding back on dark mode just like they did with night shift apple released night shift towards the end of the cycle of ios 9 so we could be seeing a dark mode towards the end of the cycle of ios 10 if you recall that but anyway guys this was just a quick update i know you guys want to know the information the performance and here it is i hope you guys enjoyed the video i'll let you guys go i hope you guys have a great day and i will catch you guys really soon peace